At the end of the week, mortgage payments for millions of Americans will be due. Many homeowners will have difficulty making those payments because of the pandemic. But as News 5's Jordan Vandenberg explains, some lenders hope the worst is over as Northeast Ohio rebounds from the coronavirus. This assistance is called mortgage forbearance. Now let's rewind for a moment and go back to the early days of the pandemic. Back in mid-March, Congress passed the CARES Act, and as part of that legislation, homeowners could have their mortgage payments reduced or put on pause entirely. In the end, it was all about buying time. Sometimes owning a home is just as stressful as buying one. As a lender and recent buyer, Ed Hensley is on both sides. When you're in the business, it's one thing, but when you have a vested stake and you, you say, hey, am I closing and what's going to happen? Hensley and his colleague, Jay Pasco, both hail from the Ohio Mortgage Bankers Association, an industry that has had to reckon with challenge after challenge because of COVID-19. From our standpoint as lenders, we're in uncharted water. We, we've never dealt with anything this fast. We're committed to making this as easy for the consumer as we possibly can for the homeowner because we don't want the homes back. We want people to stay in their homes. Nearly 4 million homeowners have sought mortgage assistance since the pandemic began, allowing them to pause their payments for up to a year without it dinging their credit score. Data shows the surge in requests back in early April has leveled off, but a new month, however, brings a new payment. Some of the benefits, like the increased generosity of the unemployment insurance, those will run out in July. So if, if uh, you know, the situation stays kind of dire for, for much longer, we may see a lot of homeowners bu bumping up against that. Yeah, I think the government with their stimulus and uh, other things that they've done to try to spur the economy has helped some people. So I think we'll know the answer to that more in the next really four to six months as to what happens. Economists say the Federal Reserve's aggressive action, including slashing interest rates, has undoubtedly helped the mortgage industry and homeowners too. But with the unemployment rate north of 14%, getting people back to work will be the biggest spring in the rebound. How many of those workers get called back? And how does that bring those numbers down? And how quick does it bring those numbers down? Is it going to bring them back down to where they were? Not overnight. As for the housing market itself in Ohio, Henzi says it remains strong. And unlike the Great Recession, housing values have remained steady or even increased in some cases. In Cleveland, Jordan Vandenberg, News 5.